Hello everybody, thank you for joining me again. I'm back at Berryhead. It's um, just coming up to sunrise, although just like last week, there's a bank of cloud covering where the sun is gonna rise. But as always, if you don't get out, you won't get that shot. This video might be a mixture of um, different clips from different places, depending on what the weather does for me this week. I was here last week in the rain. And I'm here again and uh, trying to get some images for you. My Sony 72 350mm lens has arrived. Here it is. And um, hopefully I'll be taking some wildlife shots with that later on. I'm hoping the dolphins are still here. Although, as you can see, it's a little rougher today, so it might be a little, a little bit more difficult to see them. The first shot I'm going to try, though, is this one behind me. I'm going to try and get uh, the sunrise lighting up those two rocks. The sun will actually come up a bit further over there, but hopefully I'll get a better side light. Well, I thought I'd try some long exposures. I've got the 60mm Sigma on and a 10 stop ND filter. Uh, I've just taken a couple of shots, one at um, one minute and this one is at uh, one and a half minutes. Just uh, experimenting with the exposure to get that right. I've not uh, tried to calculate it, I'm just winging it and going uh, by what I find. I'm sure lots of you out there will be uh, screaming at me now saying about uh, what software I can use or what calculations I can use to work out what the exposure is. Also, I'm using a cable release at the moment and I'm leaving it hanging so there might be a bit of vibration. All things you've got to look out for. As I think you can see by my face, the sun's just come up over the top of that cloud bank. So I'm now getting some nice light on the scene. I'm trying another one minute exposure as there's a bit more light. And we'll see, see what we find. Okay, I moved slightly and I'm now trying a minute and a half. I don't think the image is that great. The composition could be better, but it's good to be out and experiment. What I really came out for was some wildlife photography with this new lens. And I've just noticed there's a whole load of gannets just off the headland here. which means there's fish about, which means there's going to be dolphins about. Yeah, I doubt you can see them, but they're just out there. Quite a few dive bombing the water. Better get this shot.
I did just try wandering around with the uh, new lens and trying to take some shots but the gannets seem to have gone. Wind's got up a bit as well, I've come to a sheltered spot just here. So this video might be a bit abstract with uh, video and uh, photographs from different days, different times. But we'll see what we get in the end. So I think I'll look around, there's still a lot to see, the uh, slows are out on the uh, Hawthorne or is that Blackthorn bushes here, nice contrast the blue against green and um, I might get the long lens out and take some photographs of the sea, we'll see. Well, I think I might end it there. I've just come out of the wind by the bird hide, which is behind the guardhouse cafe. And um, might try and take a few more photographs of birds around here, but we'll see. Hope you enjoyed this week's video. If you did, hit the subscribe button, and I'll see you again soon. But cheerio for now. <laughs>